Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and if you have 23H2 you have one interesting change in your volume setting that is kind of nice. So of course when you click your volume settings in Windows 11 you had the panel pop up which had uh, some of the information of you know sometimes what media player is actually uh, what player actually uh, multimedia player is actually doing something or if you have, um, you know, your browser open on YouTube or Netflix or whatever. But what is nice is that if you actually go into the little, uh, the right side of the um, slider for the volume to select a sound output, you will now have every app that actually uses a volume show up independently. I've always said one of the biggest problems in Windows is that people don't realize that there's a master volume and there's an app volume. So each app could be muted, but the master volume could be on. And so you're wondering, well, my volume's on, why am I not hearing the app itself? Well, each app has its volume. So now instead of, you know, uh, bringing up either um, any controls for the sound settings or um, having to tweak with the app itself for the volume, you can go and just check it out now. It's all available. So I've opened several apps to show you that there are several volumes. So there's the main volume mixer. Here I have Edge, which is showing up because I opened Edge with a YouTube video. But if I actually shut down Edge, go back to my volume mixer, you'll notice that now it's gone from the list and so on. So OBS Studio, which I'm using for recording, VLC and Media Player are all here. Now I can actually remove this. I can remove VLC. And what we have is, let me just check the settings. And now we'll have just the main volume and my OBS studio showing up. And if you have nothing open, it's just going to be the volume mixer, the main volume that's going to be there that you can actually uh, play with. So this is nice as it uh, gives you the uh, capabilities of what's playing, what's the output and of course the output device that it's uh, going to play with. So multiple apps with different sounds, you'll have multiple volumes and sliders just at the tip of the volume control rather than having to go into the you know settings and anything for the volume mixer. It's now embedded within the taskbar when you click on the volume control. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.